What's up everybody? Thanks for tuning in. I'm going to be filming some cooking segments for you once a week. I'm going to show you some easy, simple, amazing, delicious, somewhat healthy meals um, that you can do at home whether you're cooking for two like I am. Justin forever. Come here. Y'all need to meet Justin if you don't know who he is, which most of you already do. He eats a lot of food. So I've got to continue to be cooking and keeping it interesting so that we don't get bored um, and you guys can do this for yourself. Today I'm making a healthy verde chicken casserole and I'm using a rotisserie chicken. First step, rotisserie chicken. I like to get them at Whole Foods. I usually get the smoked rotisserie chickens because they're so amazing they fall right off the bone. But today I just got a regular classic one, 10 bucks. Maybe a little bit more expensive than if you were to buy a whole chicken and cook it yourself, but honestly, it saves you time and it's more convenient. So honestly, all I'm going to do now, guys, is take a fork and I'm going to shred the chicken off and put it in a separate. know what mom's cooking too. This is Bruiser. I'm surprised Vogue hasn't jumped up here yet you guys. Normally when she smells food she's all about it but. Okay guys now that I shredded up pretty much a full bowl of chicken I'm going to start with layering the casserole. This is so easy to do. Well. <laughs> this is what he's good for. Oh let's try. It's only because I loosened it up more. It's really not that strong. Okay, so you're just gonna do a small little layer of the verde at the bottom of your pan. Real easy, just like this. And then I'm going to layer a few corn tortillas on the bottom. Three should do the trick. And now to make my sauce, I'm gonna take about two scoops of the sour cream. I actually got the low fat sour cream. I did compare the labels. Normally the original is actually sometimes healthier, but in this case, the Whole Foods um, low fat sour cream had better macros than the original. So just a little bit of the sour cream and a little bit of the verde sauce. And you stir it up and make your little mixture. So it actually looks really good. Boom, and I'm just going to spread my layer of chicken, first layer, over the tortillas, just like this. That looks so delicious. Okay guys, now I just chopped up some tomatoes and cilantro, and I'm just gonna put a few on this layer, and then sprinkle your cilantro. If you don't, so now all you do is redo your next layer. Oh, I almost forgot, sorry. You add a little cheese as well. If you want to make it more healthy, don't add the cheese, but hey, a little cheese never hurt anybody. So I'm going to sprinkle some of that on there. It's going to be so I have the oven set to 450 right now. I'm going to bake it for 10 to 12 minutes um, just to make sure that it's cooked all the way through and then it's going to be so good. Thanks for watching guys. Like I said, I am going to be doing these once a week. So if you have any favorite recipes or favorite dishes that you love and you want to see my take on them, uh, post in the comment section below. Thanks. Bye guys. Oh my goodness, guys, this smells incredible. The whole house smells amazing. And the meal took me, you guys saw, literally five minutes to make, 20 minutes in the oven, boom, 30 minute meal.